Hey guys and welcome back to another integration video. So this time we're looking at sec and tan now, yeah? So these two are kind of related because they're actually derivatives and integrals of each other. But what I'm trying to point out here is that we should always try and rewrite any forms of trig into causes and signs, as in sin sin and cos cos, okay? Now another important feature is the angle. And by the angle, I'm talking about the 4x here. And if they're the same, then this makes it a hell of a lot easier. So how about we get straight to it? I'll show you guys how I would personally break it down. So guys, as we said earlier, the first thing you guys want to do to this problem is to firstly rewrite sec and tan in terms of sine and cos. So here we can rewrite sec as 1 over cos 4x because that's the identity and tan as sine over cos. And don't forget to put 4x in both of them. Now what you want to do next is to pretty much let u equal the term in the, the denominator, which is cos 4x. And this is because that if we differentiate cos 4x, we're going to get an answer on the numerator. And that's exactly what we want. We want sine 4x to be part of the du over dx expression. Okay. This is, this is because when you do some kind of substitution, you're going to go ahead and replace the whole thing with du comfortably. So have a look here. So at the next stage, I found du over dx, which gave us the right hand term. And then the aim is to make sine 4x a subject which is du over minus 4. Now you can go ahead and replace all your terms with what you need. So I've pretty much replaced cos 4x on both of them with u, and as there's two of them, you get u squared on the bottom. And I've replaced sine 4x dx with du over minus 4. And that's it. You pretty much got an integral in terms of u. Now all we can do is literally put minus 4 on the outside because it's a constant, so literally 1 over minus 4 goes outside. Then you just have 1 over u squared to integrate. And that's easy. 1 over u squared gives you... Uh, minus one of u and because you got minus on outside it becomes a plus and that's it the rest is dead easy and by dead easy we mean don't forget to replace u with cos 4x and when you do that you guys are literally done I just want to thank you guys for coming to this end of my channel and if you've enjoyed the content so far just go into my channel page hit the subscribe button and hit the bell for more notifications and if you want you can do personalize or all and that way you won't miss any future maths or educational videos anyway guys thank you for watching and see you next time ciao